Hello viewers, my name is Dr. Moni Yadioye. I want you to subscribe to this channel and uh, also click on the notification bell so that anytime we upload new content, you'll be notified. On this channel, you will enjoy a lot of things apart from the fantastic movies that you will watch. We have other programs like Medical Tips, One on One with the Champion. And now, we are bringing other shows that you will enjoy to you. Shows like Kingdom Stars, Kineyo Banwi, and Ilerawa. All this put together will give you very fantastic moments when you engage yourself with YouTube. Please do remember to tell somebody about Ogongo TV today. We have a lot to offer you. God bless you. Ogongo TV. The League. church we are happy to have this year's ministers conference and it's my pleasure to introduce to us a great and a humble man of God we are very very glad to have him in our midst despite of his tired schedule so I believe that we shall hear from God through him so I have this singular honor to welcome to the podium nobody but Reverend Coyote Badmos all the way from the glory. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, 
everyone shout hallelujah. I bless the name of the Lord for making it possible for me to be here today. And I want to appreciate uh, this invitation from Pastor Daniel and the ministry. God bless you. Amen. I greet you all. Well, this is Coyote Badmos talking to you. Not a supernatural man of God, not a great, in quote, man of God, but a mere mortal with a great God. Yeah. Sir, please, if you will permit me, I want these young men standing at my back to please get a seat and listen to this message so that they too can be blessed of this message. I see this as a duplication of job. Because angels are on guard here. And uh, they are everywhere in this church. Angels are everywhere ensuring that we are safe. We do not need any man to perform this job again. So, please. Thank you very much. The topic we are looking into today is exchange of authority. I want you to say exchange of authority. Say that. Exchange of authority. Come on, say exchange of authority. Exchange of authority. Let us pray. Lord, I give you all the glory, honor, and adoration for this great privilege you have given unto me to be here today. I commit this hour unto your hand, O Lord. I pray that you will use me as a pure channel to dish out your words unto your servants. I pray that your word will deliver them. I pray that your word will lift them up in the spirit. Lord, answer my prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name I have prayed. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I am glad because most of us that are here today are ministers of God. We are molders of life. We are the salt of the world. The Bible says in Matthew 5.13 that you are the salt of the world. But if the salt has lost its savor, wherewith it shall be salted? It is henceforth good for nothing. And it shall be cast out and be trodden under the foot of men. Brethren, Today, ministers of God and church leaders have lost their authority, especially in the church cycle, which is their primary field. I want to tell you that this is because of our quest for power. We have left the real source of power in search of power from other sources. Sometimes in 1996, while I was praying, the Lord showed me a revelation. And uh,
Nothing! What do you want to do with it? <laughs> don't, don't do anything, silly girl. I want to use your jeep to climb my hill! <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't, don't do anything, silly girl. Did you hear what I said? And that was the dream. Hmm. But, you know what? what? I was so confused. Hmm. And I still am. But Pastor, I don't think it's something to worry about. Mm -hmm. Yes. But, one thing is needful. And that is what? <sighs> you need to watch as you pray. Hmm. Hmm. I need to watch as I pray. <laughs> how much, how much do you need to clear my goods from China? No, I want those samples, the exact ones I picked. 250 million naira. See, I don't want common lace, please. Because all my clothes are unique. 250 million naira. Hey, hey. I've prayed it to your account since now. Oh, check. Please, I will be expecting that. I will be expecting my car going anytime soon. No, 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 no. I don't want an alternative, please. No, 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 no. Please. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> All right. God bless you. God bless you. Bye. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, shit. I'll attend to you later. Oh, oh my God. What's this? This is an insult. Two hundred and fifty thousand naira for a whole week. Ouch! I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed. So these girls didn't make much money last week. Just two hundred fifty thousand naira. Oh, this is ridiculous. I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed at all. Oh. Eh? With that figure, my sister, I said 250,000 naira. I didn't say 250 million naira. My, my sister, that is so ridiculous, you know. It is so ridiculous. And it is one of the least figure we can ever make in, 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 in this place. Ah. I'm a child of God now. I'm a child of God. And my husband and I are serving God faithfully. So why won't God be faithful to us? Oh. Mm. You are right. You are right, ma. <laughs> Although, actually, I don't depend on the sales we make here. No, 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 no. I mean, why do I have a husband if he cannot take care of my responsibilities? <laughs> Even as a full-time pastor, God has really blessed my husband. And he also knows his responsibility. So he's taking good care of me and the children. You see, my sister, riches and wealth are the proofs of any minister's calling. Mm. If you know any man of God who claimed that God calls him and he's not exhibiting that, oh, you need to doubt his calling. Man, you need to doubt his calling. Um, Ma, what about the clothes you want to choose for pastor's wife program that is coming up? Yes, that reminds me. You see, for the high-level ministers who wives, like us, I mean myself and others, we can't go for any cloth that is less than 
150,000 naira. I mean, just 150,000 naira to make it convenient for everybody. At least that is fair enough for everybody to to, to get. And for 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 lower ministers' wives like you, you people should be able to go for something of um, 50,000 naira cloth. You should be able to afford that. So it will be convenient for everybody. Anything that is lesser than that, count me out. Because we are inviting people from all over the world for this program. So we can't just look so cheap. You understand? Yes. Uh -huh. I don't know. I have some samples there. Eh? I mean, this one is colorful enough, if you don't mind. Yes. I can order for more of these and of these. Just, just look they, around. They are beautiful. Okay, so which one would you like to prefer? Huh. We'll think about it. Oh, okay. We'll get back to you. Okay, so when you people are ready, so that I can order for more of this, you have enough. Yeah. And when you are ready for your head chairs, I mean your gilly, I can get you some cheaper ones. The range of 25,000 naira. And um, I think that shouldn't be difficult for you people to get. Glory's shop today. I was dazed. I kept wondering if it is the same God that called him, that called you. A minister of God like you. God showed himself in their ministry. And I pray one day, very soon, he will show himself in our ministry. Shebi, you said God called you. Shebi, he called you. Oh, is it possible for God to call someone? I'm not to call him again. Uh, Abby? Uh, my dear. Eh? Uh, how do you mean? How do I mean? If it is the same God that called you, called the Joshua's, they now come we are lacking. And your fellow minister is swimming in riches. Have you seen the new car they just bought? Fully acid. Woman. Hmm? Woman! Will you just allow me to rest? Oh. Allow you to rest. Sleep. Go on, rest. Rest. But before you rest, you need to give me Samuel's school fees. Because the teachers have even said I should not even bother to bring him to class. Because he has not paid. And you know the funny thing that happened this evening? Oh, the last beans in this house in the evening. As I was cooking, the gas finished. It finished unannounced. Unannounced. You want to rest? Rest oh, but this is not fair honey. This is not fair. I will continue to shout. I will continue to scream. Every day, Gary, 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 Gary. Do you want to kill me with oh Gary this time? 
What is this? Calm down. Leave me alone. The neighbors should be hearing what you're Let saying. Let them hear. Let them. What is it? Let everybody know what is happening in this house. Let everybody. I will continue to shout. I am ready for you tonight. Until you do the needful. What is it? Want to rest? Rest or sleep? Sleep. I can't even buy new clothes. I can't even buy new shoes. I can't even buy anything. You want to sleep? Sleep or? I am not disturbed. Just allow me to express myself. Don't even tell me not to I, I, I express myself. Oh. Gary, Gary, Gary. When last have you taken tea in this house? When last, Tony? Talk. When last? I know what. Next week, Mama is celebrating her birthday. And we know we have to put on something good. Uh -huh. So just know. Before you start sleeping. <laughs> I want to sleep. That should be enough for Samuel's fees. <sighs> Thank you so much. I'm very grateful. You're welcome. <sighs> but actually, I think something is wrong with me. How? Why do I not have testimonies in my ministry? I seem not to have anything to show for my calling. I literally beg to cater for my family. Even the smallest demon, I find it difficult to cast it out. And I serve God. I serve God faithfully. Pastor Joshua, is something not really wrong with me? Um, man of God, don't talk like that. You see, sometimes God takes us through some tests. Uh, what is happening to you may be a test from God. Uh, I don't want you to give up. Keep pressing, because by the time he is true with you, all will be well. supposed to do that I have not done. I have fasted, I have prayed, 
I even try as much as possible to live holy. Yet, my ministry is without testimony. Ah. Even my wife. My wife. Ah. My wife doesn't believe in my ministry. For how long am I supposed to stay like this? Dad, hmm? where's mom? Your mom? Um, sit down, sit down. Oh, that's your mom. Hello, honey. I'm sorry. I didn't know I would stay this long. I decided to wait after the service to see Pastor Joshua for more anointing and counseling. You know, today is his last service in our church. People are so many here, waiting to see him, and I can't jump the queue. We still have few Gary left at home. You and Salmon can settle yourself with that. I will arrange something when I come. I'm sure Pastor Joshua will not allow me to return empty-handed. <sighs> God. Um, Salmon. Your mom will soon be at home. Hmm? She will soon be at home. It's okay, dear. While Dennis thought he has fasted and prayed enough for the anointing, God was testing his patience and his ability to manage the anointing that was about to be released unto him. Honestly speaking, many children of God have died before their time, and many have been injured because of their inability to manage the anointing of God. Some men of God are in this position, and a lot of them are just getting frustrated in the ministry for nothing. <sighs> Brethren, the story continues. Man of God. Ah, ah, man, man of God. God. Ah, ah. Man of God. Good to see you. Ah, and you too. How is the ministry? No bad. Reverend, man of God. Reverend, man of God. I'm so happy to meet you, sir. Good to see you. Is this really you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus. How is everything? Very fine, sir. I am Pastor Joshua. Hey, sit down, sit down. Sit down. How is the ministry? No bad. Wow. We thank God. The last time I heard about you, I learned you were in Australia. Yes, even from Australia to Canada, then Canada to U.S., I think. Wow, wow. The ministry is booming, man. Sure, sure. Praise, the Lord has been so praise good. Praise God. The Lord has been so good. Praise so how is your God. side, too? The Lord is good, man. Wow. Yeah, I've been moving from nations to nations. Glory to, to God. Wow. Glory it's to God. massive, man. Wow. <laughs> that has been great. Praise it's God. been great. Praise wow. <sighs> oh. Man of God. <sighs> Oh, you have done inside? Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Thank ah. you, sir. Okay. Alright, sir. Wanna go? Let's go. Alright, sir. Okay, okay. okay. Mm. Oh my god. Is it always like this? How do you mean? <laughs> oh. Ah, I think you know. You understand. Oh, I know. Anyway, it is well. <sighs> it is well. My lord, this is Dennis, my friend that I spoke to you about. He needs your special anointing because he desperately wants help and breakthrough in his ministry.
Have you told him the details? No, my lord. I want him to find out himself. <laughs> Burundi judge! Burundi judge! Burundi judge! Butonda diva! Butonda diva! Butonda diva! <laughs> Give me that vibe. have noticed this before now! Ah -ah! Wait, wait, so this is what you have been doing. Using demonic powers to perform signs and wonders so that children of God can be extorted by bringing their things and pouring them at your feet? My God. Ah! For your information, I am not interested in your so-called stupid Burundi nonsense! Oh, you might have burnt my Bible. But see, <laughs> see, I have so many at home because I am a true Bible scholar. Nonsense. And please let me send you back to your priest. Tell that your priest that I, I am not interested. <laughs> you dare not. You want to back out? No, you are here already. After you have known the secret of so many ministers of God, it is not possible. It's like, I didn't get you. Did you say so many ministers of God? <laughs> you are joking. <laughs> Who are ministers of God? Who are ministers of God? I am not interested. Thank you. Now watch your mouth! Don't risk your life. You are playing with the tail of a tiger. Apostle! Apostle! Apostle, please help me! Please help me, my daughter is dying! My daughter is dying, please! Please help me! Daniela! Please! Apostle, please, I beg 
of you. Please help me. Please help oh, me. Calm down, madam. Madam, calm down. Okay. Calm down. Hey, 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 woman, woman, woman. Stop deceiving yourself by bringing your daughter to fake pastors like this. I won't take that insult from you. Please. Um, look here, look here, woman. Take her to a genuine man of God that will cast out the demon in this young girl in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Welcome on board. It works. What works? You just performed a miracle. For restoring my daughter back to life. It's uh, how much do you have there? It's just 200,000 naira. How much is in here? 200,000 naira. 200,000 naira. I promise to bring the remaining balance, sir. No. He performed the miracle. Okay, okay, sir. Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> Please, sir, have it. It's yours, sir. Yes, it's yours. It's, it's just a token. I promise to bring the remaining balance. I promise. Yes, sir, have it. Of it, sir. <laughs> I, I promise to bring the remaining balance. I'll bring it. Yes, I promise. Have it, sir. Take it. Yes, it's yours. Have it. Thank you, sir. God will bless you. God will bless your ministry. God will bless your own children. Okay, madam. God bless you. Amen. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I promise to bring the remaining balance. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Man of God, <laughs> welcome on board. <laughs> so, what did you say? has changed about me. Many things. Many things, Pastor. <clears throat> Bishop. Bishop. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bishop. Better. 
But that is one of those things that have changed about you. We are friends. You are no longer our humble brother that we used to know. Me? Brother? What insolence? Oh. It appears I've over-tolerated you people. We are so sorry about that, Bishop. We just want to call your attention to your previous messages and to your recent ministrations. Uh, besides that, sir, the way you left the church, sir, is not proper, sir. Will you shut up? Oh. I can see that um, you have not both been properly schooled. I think I should get some reasonability into your senses. I am a bishop. And your Gio is an ordinary pastor. So do you expect a homie, a bishop like me, to be under your pastor Gio? Huh? No way. That is impossible. You may not know, but God, has instructed me to start my own ministry. And I want to believe you don't have a problem with that. Do you? Mm -hmm. It appears that uh, you're not comfortable with uh, the recent wind of glory that the Lord is blowing over my life and ministry. Sir, I want to suggest you leave now. Because right now, my husband is angry. And I don't want him to use his anointing against you. Leave. Leave now. Right now. I'm so sorry, my lord. My wife caused it. She insisted on following me to this room where I usually have my special prayers every Wednesday. And since I know that uh, she is lazy spiritually, I engaged her with some prayers in our room because I know that she will soon fall to sleep. But unfortunately, she slept late today. Once again, my lord, I'm so sorry. Your wife? wife? Yes, my lord. Don't you worry. We will, we will soon see to, to our case. case. It's all right. Burundi, Burundi judge. judge. Buton Dadiba. <laughs> you are welcome, welcome to this new level. Mm. You are now the general, general overseer. overseer. Of Excess Grace, Grace International, International Group of Churches. Church. 
It is by your grace, my lord. And I will forever be grateful. Well, as you know, that in this our society, to every new level you get, there's always a sacrifice. Yes, my lord. Sacrifice this time. It's the life of your son. My son? No. No. Samuel. Oh, Samuel. How are you? And how was good today? Mm, good. Yes? The devil gives you sorrow. He gives to take from you. Everything he gives is a counterfeit of the real. Why didn't you eat? I know mom did not give you food. This morning, because you do have me. But she gave me. So I didn't eat mine in school so you could have something. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You see, um, it is not uh, really like that. Actually, um, I'm fasting. Dad, I'm simply fasting because there's no food for you to eat. If there was food, there won't be fast. Besides, it's even evening. When will you break your fast? Please eat this. I don't want my dad to be sad because I love you. Oh, I love you too, my boy. I love you too. I want you to go to the kitchen and uh, pick another spoon so that we can eat it together. Hmm? Thank you, God, for giving me this wonderful one. Samuel! God bless you, people of God. And thank you all for coming. We know that we should give thanks to God in all things. Mm -hmm. It gives and it takes away. <laughs> to him alone be all the glory. <sighs> Listen to me. No single drop of tears must come from your eyes over the death of your son, or else you will go blind for the rest of your life. We, we thank God for your faith, sir. Uh, please, encourage mommy to take it easy. Huh? Take what easy? I said take what easy. Oh, Samuel. Samuel is gone. Oh. Uh. Samuel. Very strong. 
strong and brave. Oh God, why me? What's this time? Oh God, please, 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 please. Oh, Samuel, this is serious. But why him? I can't even understand. Why? Why in time like this? Why must this happen to be sure then? Anyway, let's get there first. Oh, Lord. Sister Wala! Sister, eh? Sister Comfort! She's the one! Sister Wala, what a name! Uh -huh. <laughs> How are you? We are fine. fine. <laughs> and you? I'm fine. Okay. Is this your car? Exactly. This is the new car Bishop Dennis just bought for me. <laughs> wow! So massive! Yeah. Thank you. Say you see the again. reason why I've been telling you to change your church. Exactly. Yeah. At least if you can come to Apostle Joseph's church, you can come to Bishop Dennis' church and your life will change for better. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly, Sister Wura. Anyway, my sister, <laughs> I'm okay the way I am. Huh? Okay like this. Sister Wura. You're okay like this. <laughs> You're okay. Wow. Anyway, where are you people going? Oh. <sighs> Bishop Dennis just lost his son. Hey! What? Samuel? Jesus! Was he sick? Not at all. So it was just sudden. I think it is just a trial of fate. And do you know what? Devil is a liar. Yes, because my pastor did not lose his maturity, even in all this. He did not allow it to get to him at all. He's mm. still standing, holding fast to his faith. Mm. He did not cast God. Mm. Neither did he murmur against him. He still hold on fast to God, even in all this. I know devil is not happy with his high level of anointing. Shame on you, devil. Shame unto him. My pastor is still standing firm in faith. My pastor did not backslide. Shame on the devil. Shame. Shame unto him. Shame. Anyway, hmm. when you get there, help me to agree there. It is well. Um, Sister Wura. Come on. Uh -uh. Let's, Let's give you a ride. I'll give you a ride. Oh. Sister Wura. Everything changed in the life of Dennis. Not all blessings are from the devil. But the blessing of God, we had no sorrow. Dennis now held the mega church, but the faithful brethren remained in their call. I hope you can still remember Dennis' dream. You see, the devil cannot take over your ministry without a proud warning from God. Ten years later, God led Pastor Mike and Pastor Goke and their team to Kona Village for evangelism. Yes, sir. Again, Moshe, and you can see your body out to me. Oh, we can't. 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 Jesus <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm going to see you in the back of the car. Oh, Tony, oh, Tony. Eh, you didn't even know me. That's what I know. That's what I'm sorry. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to see you. 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 I'm going to any any akoko ti wo ko faye re fu Jesus ni abule hmm hmm amo 
ni oju se pataki lati se eh eh na ni lo lati ma wa su jesu fun gbugbu awon to ku ni abule kan le di atu bibiti eh emi wu lo bawo i ru lo bawo sugbon ni sinti mo ti o mo yi ah ni sinti mo ti mo yi ah emi na o bere seri okori okori ile okori yi mbeni ti bere ore mi ni mbeni ti bere ile te nowo sini si mo se akiyesi pe titi pa lo wa lati ana ta ti de so travel ni ah baba baba ah ta fu ke baba eh agbe agbe pawo ni o agbe gbori gidi agbe gidi ni o agbe ni eh ni bi odun me lo kan seyin lo de ni lo lo fe ma dako ba le wa se ko yen mo ra lo ba fun ni le ja eh opolopo ojo ni mo nlo loko opolopo ojo ni mo nlo sugbon to ba ti lo ba o yo pe ko to de sugbon ni na ni o de lo ni ni o de eh a je pe a ma ri won ko to di pa lo ah ibe lati bere ibe lati bere eh ibe lati bere olowo eh eh ni kanju lo le yi o e tu do ti wa de o tori to ba ti ri bayi se ninu mi won do bori pe bori pe ba ngbe mu ดาวเบอร์ก็ฟิกาเชบาบาลาอ่าเอมุโบตุนีอ่าโลเดเอติฟายเอยิฟุเจซูอามเมมูอามูกุโรโคซิเนมอ่าเอเนมอ่าเอ
is a lamb to feed all the real. Nothing now, nothing now. Nothing now. Nothing now. That's it now. Nothing they prove. Nothing. Are you sure? Yeah. Uh -uh. Come down, come down, come down. I want to see what is in the room. Okay, take join now. Join now. Calm down, Mr. Man. What do you mean? Come out. Come down. Come out. Open your boots. Officer, come down. Come out. Open your boots. We tell you say we the rush. We the rush. I beg. I don't hear you. Come out. Open your boots. Officer, I beg now. Come down. Come down. We need to Come see what we have in your boots. Let's see what we have there. Don't tell you say we are busy now. Let's come out here. Okay, I want to do like this. So now we get this place. So just open your boots. I beg open your boots now. Open. Open your boots. Open. Oga, you want to come and see me? Ah, ah. Ah. Oga. mentioned my name to the police. And I became wanted. That was why I ran away to this place where I would not be recognized. You really went too far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pastor! Pastor Dennis! Just as you told me in your dream. <sighs> so, you eventually allowed the devil to collect the Bible and the hymn from your hands in replacement with cutlass and hope. You ran away to this place where nobody will know you as a child of God. Oh my God. I wonder why God insisted we must come to this far away remote village for an evangelism. He wants us to fish out a lost soul of his dear son. Mm. Oh, he's not lying about that. Mm. <sighs> oh my God. Ah. <sighs> ah. Pastor Dennis, you need to confess your sin and return to Jesus <gasps> and return to him. <sighs> he needs you. You need to return to him. <sighs> return to him. <laughs> Before it's too late. Lord. 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 Lord.
surrendered to the police. He was charged to court and convicted to 25 years jail term. There are so many of us here today. The devil is out there to collect the Bible in our hand. The Bible calls him the enemy of our soul. And he uses a lot of strategies like crave for power, covetousness, riches of this world and many more that we need to watch out for as ministers of the gospel. Just as I am without one plea, but that thy blood was shed for me, and that thou beest me come to. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, brethren, this young man of God says he has a confession to make. Please, let us listen to him. My name is Pastor Tunde. I've been in the ministry for 17 years. 17 years of fruitless labor and struggle. Last month, I met a man who introduced me to an occultist. He promised to give me power for my ministry. I was asked to come back today for the initiation ceremony. As I was entering the town, I saw the banner of this program, Power That Saves. Something pushed me here, only to come and realize that my life was being preached. I could not wait for the pastor to make an altar call before coming out. I decided to come out. Well, I am convinced in my spirit that it is not only Pastor Tunde that is in this type of situation here. You may not have taken a bold step, but you have decided in your mind that you will seek for an alternative power and authority in exchange for the authority you have from God. Hmm. Hebrew 2.3 says, how shall we escape if we neglect so great salvation, which at the first began to be spoken by the Lord and was confirmed by them that heard him. This is the opportunity for you, brethren. His mercy is available for you now. Come unto him. Why can't you come out today? Come on to him. His mercy is available for you. He will clean you up. Pastor Tunde, join him. The Lord is here. He is ready to forgive you. Just for you to come, please come. Don't mind whatever situation you have now. Just as I am without one plea, but now thy blood was shed for me.
Yeah.